Greetings, dear viewers! I'm Quill Quickcard, and welcome back to Metroid Dread. Where, once again, I am fully expecting... Ah! To have a very bad time. Ah, damn it. Yeah, that's about as well as I expected that to go. But that's okay. Because this time, I am beating it. I am beating this boss, and nothing will stop me. Okay, wait for it. Nope! Dodge the red, dodge the red! Okay, up here. Ah, crap. I already know that at some point I'm going to have to parry this attack. Nope. Okay. Wait for it. Damn it! That's okay. That's okay. It's been a day since I recorded. I have to rebuild. Okay. There we go. I have to rebuild my reflexes. Got him! Okay. It's not exactly helpful to parry that very first attack. But I will take it. Nope. Dodge the red. Always dodge the red. The blast radius on that is crazy. Okay. Up here. Damn it. Missed the parry on that. Okay. Damn it. Nope. Dodge the red. Oh my god, I got him! <laughs> oh, yes, yes. Oh, thanks. Oh, praise be to the merciful gods. That I managed to take that thing out. Holy crap. Okay. That was extremely unplut out. Come on, you little jerks. Excuse me. Thank you. Now, please. Give me a power-up. That is going to help me survive. Preferably something that's going to help me take out these damn things faster. Okay. I don't need to be nervous here. The Emmy is offline. That's a green door. Can't open it. That's a blue Emmy. Don't have to worry about it right now. Through the door. Okay. Wait for it. Gotcha. Those things may like to delay their attacks quite a bit. But I played Elden Ring and I know how to handle delayed attacks now. By not freaking out. Samus, you are approaching the surface. This area, Gathering, appears to be an underground forest. I have so many questions about how that's remotely possible. The enemy have been deactivated, but Raven Beat still desires the Metroid DNA within you. I have reviewed the video log of your encounter after your arrival. Yeah. You were no match for him then. You are no match for him now. It is true that you have recovered many of your combat abilities. However, my analysis suggests that you would not be a worthy adversary for him, not even at full power. Uh huh. One thing still eludes me. Why did Raven Beat spare you during that encounter? Something must have motivated him. Okay. 
Uh, can't go through there, obviously. Nope. Ah. Ow! Try that again, you little jackass. Okay. I'm almost... Oh, boy. Gotcha. Nope. Okay. Go ahead. Nope. You're not getting through. Hmm. Oh, this room. Okay. This guy I remember as being kind of a jerk. But, not so much of a jerk that I can't deal with him. Hmm. Gotcha. Is the answer... over here? Okay, that's... That's another transporter. Because we haven't had enough of those. Whoa! Holy crap! There we go! This is what I've been waiting for. Now, it will take about five times less missiles to kill those things. Plus... I can get through the green doors. Okay. Oh, that is sweet. Ow. Okay, you know what? Yeah, maybe you're meant to be a target for my super missiles, but screw it. I do not care. Boom. Let me in. You know what? Screw you. And screw you too. And that way leads to the ten missiles. But I cannot reach it right now. Still, I should leave a marker on my map. Because getting... Getting those ten missile bonus things is really important. Yep, let me in, let me in. Thank you, let me up. And blast. Thank you. And through here. Okay. Gotcha. Hello. Gotcha. I'm actually surprised how long the uh, hitbox on the parry mechanic actually lasts. Really? Uh. Okay, well. I have two shuttles out of here. Ooh. Ooh. Do I finally get to go to Elun? Please tell me yes. This is one of my favorite areas in the game. I am calm. I am patient. Because I know that I can succeed. I don't need to worry. Uh, 
I sincerely do not know why they had this door open. Like, unless someone manually opened this door, which is possible, I do not know what automatic system would have allowed this door to open. And even if it could be opened manually, I do not know why anyone would have allowed this door to have been opened manually. This is an area of total top security, and there is no rational reason it should have been accessible by anyone ever short of physically blasting their way in. Oh, crap. Oh, no, okay. That is a plasma door, which I can't do anything with. This is where things start to get a little crazy. And I cannot wait. That's a long time. There's... Yep. Oh, yeah. I... kind of freaked when I saw this. When I realized that there were X in here. And that even with the super missiles, I was looking at that many hits to defeat them. It is honestly hard to really describe how cool it is to see the X again after Metroid Fusion and to have them actually behave in pretty much the same way that they always did. It is tremendously fun. Oh, nope. Come on, you. Oh. Well, screw you, buddy. Hello! If you have never played Metroid Fusion, and you love, uh, Metroid games, go play Fusion. You can find it. It is possible. And I just got myself... A frickin' plasma beam. My attacks are now stronger than ever. I can shoot through multiple enemies. I can damage... You know what? Just in every possible way, I am stronger than before. And look how quickly I can blast through some of these targets. You little... Jerk. That's okay. Um. So there was a door up there. Gotcha. And kaboom. Gotcha. Nothing I can do there. Whoop. Nope, 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 nope. Gotcha. Yeah, how's that for an ominous looking door? 
Hello. Ow! You little ass. Give me back my frickin' energy! <sighs> now this I remember very well. Because you end up fighting so many of these throughout the game. And that suits me just fine. Hello, Chozo Warrior. Come on, buddy. Come on. Come on! There you go! Unfortunately, my memory here isn't perfect! Alright. Whoa! Ah, damn. Dodged right into him. Okay. That's fine. It's meant to be hard. But, it can be as hard as it wants. Because I am used to hard games. And I can manage them. Yoink! Should be just about ready for the second phase. Yup, there we go. Ow. Okay. Ah, uh, I did it again. All I had to do was stand still, and it would not have hit me. That's okay, though. I got this. Yoink! I am not going to let you beat me again. Alright, we should be just about ready. There we go. Okay, second phase. Okay. Go ahead, jump to the wall. Jump to the middle. That's what it was. Okay. Yep, go ahead. Jump to the wall. Dodge the projectile. Dodge over your head. Keep blasting you. You're almost dead. Ah, crap! Okay. So, I mistimed the parry. That's fine. Mmm. And then he jumped to the wall right as I dodged. Very impressive, my friend. Very impressive indeed. Let's see if you can pull off that trick again. I am willing to bet that you can't. Yoink. Alright, second phase. I just have to remember to really get that parry at the end. Okay. There we go. Dodge, dodge. Fire the missiles. Dodge. We should be pretty close to the parry now.
Okay. Got him. And got him. And straight down the throat. is how you beat a Chozo warrior. Now... Um... There we go, okay. Yes! Another entire energy tank. That might even be enough to keep me alive for an entire extra hit. Or not, depending on the fight. God knows these things hit so freaking hard at this point in the game. Okay, can you... Yeah, just let me... Okay. Thank you. All right, that's a fall only. So the path of progress is here. Wait. For it. And. Okay. Nope. Not there. Hmm. There we go. What do we got? Ow. You're a little jerk, you know that? Okay. Ah, okay. So that's a power bomb hole. Interesting. Where am I going, and why am I going there? That is the question that must always be asked in this game. Oh, am I actually gonna pick up a power bomb upgrade? Wow. Okay, you know what? That's worth getting. And then that just opens up right there. Okay. Fair enough. Ow. Uh, so I was all the way up here? Which... Ultimately doesn't really... You know what? Screw it. I'm just gonna use my iframes and get out of there. Thank you. Maybe next time don't be a jerk. Hello. Thank you. Nope. Not letting you hit me. Hello. Nope. Gotcha. Okay, so that leads, whatever, honestly all I have to do is get out of this area now, I really don't need to sweat it. Okay, that's an exit only. Ow. Excuse me. Thank you. 
Excuse me. Thank you. Ow. Thank you. Excuse me. Then I guess I'm just going back through the boss room. Simple enough. Unfortunately, there is now a small problem. Because I was smart enough to, uh, you know, bypass their entirely necessary security measures, I have just unleashed an incredibly powerful, incredibly intelligent exoparasite onto an entire planet. A parasite capable of killing, mimicking, and absorbing information from just about any organic or mechanical form of life. So, whoops, that one's on me. But, this does mean that now I have an idea of where to go next, because I did have that second, uh, that second zone transport that I found earlier. Uh, the one basically in the room right below where I'll be dropping off. And I believe that one goes back to, uh... You know what, I don't, I, I honestly don't have a freaking clue. I can't remember where any of these damn things connect. But this does not look good. The X do not reanimate. They replicate. This is not the Thoha that we saw die before our eyes. This is a copy of it. And it has the instinctive will to survive and an understanding of its own nature to a degree. It's not clear if the X truly have any sentience in their native state. But once they start absorbing sentience, they are completely capable of exploiting it in order to further their own survival. Okay, could you... Thank you. Don't mind me. As you can see, the, uh, the ex-parasites have begun taking over the native life. This means that essentially now there are stronger forms in just about every location. It's actually really unfortunate. Uh... Yeah, so I still have to go back around... I don't know. Adam, Adam will figure it out. Uh, I don't think he's going to be too happy about me releasing the X, though. The X have been released from their confinement. They have now scattered across the planet. This is no doubt the work of Raven B. Uh... Sure. We'll go with that story. His motives are still a mystery. But your Metroid DNA grants you immunity to the X parasites. You can even absorb them. Perhaps it was some kind of message. Uh, is the message Regardless, maybe don't let them out? The are here. They are overrunning the planet. They must be destroyed. Hurry to your ship, Samus. I trust you will make it here safely. Okay. So... Unfortunately, the next... Oh, no. 
Uh, yeah. So that is a stronger enemy now. That means I basically have to completely relearn the counter timings for all of these things. Also, there's an Emmy zone up ahead. That's kind of a problem. Because the Emmy are hunting me again. Okay. Just wait for it. Alright! I did it! Uh, thank you! At least it doesn't look like these things have been- Oh! Nope, they have been completely taken over by the X. Ooh. No! No, no. Um, so I don't see any way out of this, unless there's a, uh, a bombable block in the ceiling, which there is. Okay. That's good. Ooh, a map room! Yes, this will be extremely helpful. This will help me find the uh, central core, and if I can reach that, then I can take down this Emmy too. After all, they're only a threat to me if they are alive. And I promise you, they will not be for long. But I think I'll have to kill them all on the next one.